Take a look at these two videos. Can you tell a difference? So about 20% of you guys have the new bean bots. And when I first tried it out, this is what happened. Okay, look, something doesn't look, why does that look so odd? Something don't look right, and I don't know what it is. It don't look like me. Oh, I can point, whoa. Whoa. You! Maybe his head's a different shape? This looks more like that, but, whoa, I get giant head. Yo, check out my new shades, bro. They're just straight up just blue, son. I believe the head shape and the beard size is what is making him not look right. I was able to line up the eyes and the mouth pretty okay though. All right, so what all is different about these upgraded beans? Well, mainly it's that your hands are smaller and when you point, your glove stays on instead of disappearing. I actually feel like I'm liking this feature the more I play with it. You can also do this if you sit while standing. Oh man, it's been a hard day at work. Let me take a good, nice seat. Oh. They also added sliders for head size, and now you can add nose and eyebrows to your beans. There's also these new options under experience where you can show your torso while you're in bean. And then we have an option to always show your hands when you grab stuff versus them disappearing. And then of course we have the option to use classic bean. Keep in mind, however, the old bean is gonna go away. I was able to listen in on a developer AMA and I learned some pretty cool things there. Dynamic clothing, I remember them talking about being able to animate like clothing that maybe is animated in some way, like being able to like change colors. Upgraded beans will unlock development for even more exciting features like dresses that flow with your movement. So that would be pretty cool to have cloth that like follows you instead of being static. That'd be really cool. More advanced sliders to customize your avatar's form. They were talking in that AMA about like sliders for like everything, like thickness of certain body parts and stuff like that. So I believe somebody said to make it like almost so you can kind of be more truly unique in a way. Like finger tracking? That'd be crazy. Creators can add more things to their rooms and have more players in them. In that AMA thing, they talked about possibly in the future, a hundred people being in the same room. That would be amazing. Imagine the videos, imagine the chaos. So how do you feel about the new upgraded bean avatars coming out? You remember when full body avatars first came out? I kind of feel like my reaction to this is the same as that. And you can watch that here. I'll see y'all man out.